Hi everyone. Today I'll be showing you a demo on healthcare insurance part in healthcare domain of ERP Next. I'll be explaining you complete end-to-end -end workflow of health insurance part. Before going to the workflow, let us understand some of the insurance related doc types. The insurance related doc types such as insurance payer, insurance payer contract, insurance payer eligibility plan, patient insurance policy, patient insurance coverage, claim insurance, item insurance eligibility. Coming to this insurance payer doc type, in insurance payer doc type here you will be creating an insurance organization which are responsible for making the payment of any program of healthcare insurance. Here in this insurance payer doc type I have created a insurance uh, organization called as Tata AIG. Okay, and this insurance payer doc type is linked with the insurance payer contract, insurance payer eligibility plan, and patient insurance policy doc types. In insurance payer contract, we'll be having all the details of the insurance payer contract. And in insurance payer eligibility plan, here we'll be having an active plan which comes under this insurance payer, where uh, previously where I have said that I have created an insurance pair called as Tata AIG under this the active plan is Tata Lifesaver plan I have created an active plan called as Tata Lifesaver plan and in insurance pair eligibility plan doc type is linked with the item insurance eligibility and patient insurance policy patient insurance coverage here in the item insurance eligibility here we will be adding the items which are covered under this active plan tata lifesaver plan here the uh, the items which i have added is like blood test insulin resistant test and many more tests can be added here in this item which can be uh, which can be uh, uh, claimed by the active plan and this was all about the insurance related doc types now let us see how the workflow works well i have created a patient called as henry thomas and he is having an uh, uh, insurance policy i will be updating his insurance policy here he has an insurance policy with the insurance payer has Tata AIG and his uh, insurance policy expiry date is updated here. Okay, and policy number has 1134 and his insurance plan is Tata Lifesaver plan. I'll save, submit. Okay, now I have added the uh, insurance policy details of the patient and whenever the patient uh, henry thomas whenever he want to have an appointment with the practitioner he will book a patient app appointment by going to the patient appointment portal he will be selecting the healthcare practitioner and appointment type as follow up and at the time of appointment itself there is a field called insurance here will be updating his insurance policy number details okay and check the availability of the practitioner book the appointment here the appointment has been booked now the practitioner he will be creating a patient encounter for the henry thomas he'll go to the patient encounter and he'll be creating the patient encounter updating all the necessary details healthcare service you need occupation and it's all the basic details of the patient and at the time of appointment uh, at the time of encounter he will be suggesting or prescribing some of the medications and uh, investigations and uh, this can be uh, claimed by the patient if he has a insurance policy at the time of billing i'll be showing the process okay here comes the patient encounter completes save okay submit now the patient encounter completed go to the patient and at the time of invoicing we'll do the sales invoice for the patient henry thomas yeah we can directly fetch the items by going to get item from all the healthcare services here we'll be having all the healthcare services which was prescribed for the patient 
and his appointment piece as well as we can just add it for the billing yeah this is the total bill the total bill is 16350 now when you submit save submit when you submit the sales invoice the amount label is created against the patient here the amount label is created against the patient now as i said the total amount is 16350 under this the insurance coverage amount can be claimed by the patient it is total 8000 and the patient payable amount is 8 8350 okay now we need to claim the insurance we'll go for insurance claim doc type and need to claim the patient uh, insurance policy and the patient name entry thomas this policy number and insurance payer is tata aig due date payment mode of insurance bank transfer claim save submit then update the claim status okay now let us pass check go to patient sales invoice it is partially paid that means claim has been accepted now after the after the company accepts the claim that is the label against the patient is reversible up to the amount of claim accepted by the insurance company through the journal entry now here is the journal entry here the, it is automatically done and uh, the insurance company will accept the claim and uh, the insurance company tata aig has accepted the claim and the journal entry has been done for 3000 and for 5000 total was 8000 now go to the patient sales invoice let us check it is partially paid now the amount patient payable amount has to be done it is done by creating the payment here go to payment mode can give any payment mode save submit submit the total amount has been paid cross check yeah henry thomas amount has been paid let us refresh we'll get paid here yeah the total amount has been paid and there is a general ledger created against the patient and here is the total bill and total amount has been paid by the patient and claim has been accepted this was a complete process of insurance how the workflow works how the claim happens for the patient